Five tips for the perfect guitar solo. Soloists have a tough job, like an athlete called in to score the winning point. But when it all goes right, there's nothing more perfect than a perfect solo. Here are five tips to help you reach perfection. One, tell a story. Music has often been compared to storytelling. Every story has a buildup and a climax, and so should a good guitar solo. Start simple. Leave something in the tank so you can build up to that moment of musical bliss. Your audience will thank you for it. Two, don't be afraid of silence. Solos don't exist just to show off, at least not always. Taking a minimalistic approach might be just what a song needs. Even for more intense solos, use silence like an instrument itself in brief moments that create tension and emotional impact. Three, use dynamics. Dynamics have always been one of music's greatest tools and the mark of a truly great musician. Don't blast through a solo hitting every note at full volume. Play some soft notes or even a series of soft notes to create mini buildups within the larger story you're telling. Four, play with vibrato. Vibrato is the icing on the cake. It's what gives character to the notes you're playing. If you met a person with a monotone character, you probably wouldn't like him, so don't do that in your solos either. Change the pace and force of the vibrato between notes and moments for a more interesting solo. This is more about feeling than technique. Play around and see what sounds best to you. Five, go back to your roots. Experimenting is fantastic and broadens your musical horizons, but everyone has that soloist who made them want to pick up a guitar and shred for the very first time. Revisit these songs and musicians for renewed inspiration. Besides, you'll almost certainly be coming back with a new perspective, meaning you can learn even more from the music you love. Did we leave anything out? What's your most important advice for nailing the perfect solo?